Before we start anything, let's think about how we can solve this question. Basically, here we have a product of x over square root 1 plus x squared and ln x plus square root 1 plus x squared. So, we can use the integration by parts method to simplify this integral. We can find the integral of x over square root 1 plus x squared using the equation integral fx to the power of n times f dash x or differentiation of fx equals fx to the power of n plus 1 over n plus 1. But we don't have any direct equation for integral of ln x plus square root 1 plus x squared. So we can give priority to x over square root 1 plus x squared for integration. Then we can use ln x plus square root 1 plus x squared for differentiation. Clear? Let's jump into the question. Let's consider x over square root 1 plus x squared. To get integral of this value, we can use the equation integral fx to the power of n times f dash x or differentiation of the fx equals fx to the power of n plus 1 over n plus 1. Square root value 1 plus x squared we can write as 1 plus x squared to the power of half. Then we can write this value from the numerator as 1 plus x squared to the power of minus half. Now we have fx value 1 plus x squared n value minus half. So we need to find f dash x value or differentiation of the fx value. Differentiation of the fx value equals 0 plus 2x because constant value 1 differentiation equals 0 and x squared differentiation equals 2x. So we need to find this 2x value. We can write 2 value in the numerator. To cancel out this 2 value, we can put another 2 value in the denominator. Then we can write 1 over 2 value outside of the integral. Then we have integral 1 plus x squared to the power of minus half times 2x times ln x plus square root 1 plus x squared. Now we can apply the integration by parts method. Integral of 1 plus x squared to the power of minus half times 2x value we can write as 1 plus x squared to the power of half over half. In here fx equal 1 plus x squared n equals minus half and f dash equal 2x. So n plus 1 value equals half. We can write ln x plus square root 1 plus x squared value as it is. Then minus integral 1 plus x squared to the power of half over half times differentiation of the ln x plus square root 1 plus x squared. Differentiation of the ln x plus square root 1 plus x squared value we can write as 1 over square root 1 plus x squared. Denominator value half is a constant. So we can bring this half value outside of the integral. Then we have 1 over half integral instead of 1 plus x squared to the power of half we can write square root 1 plus x squared. Now we can cancel out numerator 1 plus x squared square root value for the denominator 1 plus x squared square root value. Denominator of the denominator value we can write as numerator. So 1 over half value we can write as 2. Now we have half within bracket 2 times square root 1 plus x squared ln x plus square root 1 plus x squared minus 2 integral 1. Integral 1 value equals x. Then we can get 2 as a common factor and cancel out this 2 value for the denominator value 2. Then we have the final answer as square root 1 plus x squared ln x plus square root 1 plus x squared minus 6.